Dog Training here in New Braunfels, Texas. Today I have with me a brand new board train. This dog was found on Eisenhower Road. I think somebody dumped him off. I haven't got a whole lot of information yet, but he's got a pretty good wound on the back of his neck there. Uh, so kudos to the guy for picking him up and taking his dog in and giving him some love and giving him a home. So uh, his age is unknown at the time, but he's got some male reactivity. He's, you can see he's a leash puller. Um, so they want to just get some basic manners and some obedience out of this dog. I think he knows sit kind of well. I did that a while ago. Elsie, sit. Sit. Elsie is a pit bull boxer mix. So let's see what he knows. He's interested in the floor right now. Elsie, sit. Sit. Good boy. Good sit. Oh, you can down. Down. Good boy. So let's go and see how he does on the walk. As you can see, he's a he's a pretty good puller. Kelsey, come. Good boy. He's not pulling so bad now. So we're going to get to work on him today and see what we can do in the next 15 days. And so don't forget to check us out and watch his amazing transformation in the next 15 days. And don't forget to check out all of our pups on our social media platforms. Thank you. And have a great day. And thank you for choosing Bulletproof Dog Training.
honestly, uh, I am beyond like, excited and happy uh, that Chip was able to uh, train my dog, Izzy. Uh, he did have problems uh, obeying some certain commands, and also it was hard for me to have the time to uh, to train him well. And I wanted it to be done professionally. Thankfully, Chip was able to get. I'm um, thankful for bulletproof training to uh, get my dog the training that he needs, and that way he'd be a better companion for me out there uh, in the public, out in parks and stuff. So, thank you, thank you, Chip.